Hi guys, in this video, I am going to discuss about temporary table in my SQL database. So, at here, I am using the table EMP. So, this is the record inside the table EMP. And here, so this is the record inside the table DPT. And here, the definition of temporary keyword. So, to get the in table temporary, so we have to use temporary keyword. And here, after that, you can create the temporary table. And here, or temporary table is visible only the current session or it work when the session is running when you close this session after that temporary table automatically delete when the session is closed and here i already written this query so this is add here so create temporary table the name i have given 10 and this is all our existing table so add here select e so e uh, is the alias of EMP table and here D is the alias of DPT table. So at here I am selecting from EMP table here. This is the EMP table and let's see the records. So this is the EMP table here. So I am selecting EMP number and here from our DPT select or DPT table I am selecting D name and here uh, so I am using round functions. And here sum e dot sum. So add your round function. So whatever the value 800. So 800. So I'm using round function. Then here 800.00 that display. And this is the alias salary. And here from EMP E. So is the alias of EMP table. And uh, here I'm using inner chant. So add your DPT table. This is the alias of DPT table. Now here after this is the condition on. So d dot dpt number equal to e dot dpt number. So if this condition is true, so this this condition is true. Uh, so after that, that do the joining and here first that make all the group of e dot dpt number. So this is the dpt number. So at here there are multiple duplicate records are there. So 10, 20, 30, it's all a duplicate. So at here uh, that make a dpt number 10, one group, 20, one group, 30, one group. After that, do the joining. And here, whatever the records it's get, so add here that sort in the uh, salary on descending wise. So this is on our exiting table, and here this is I'm creating by using this exiting table. I'm going to create the temporary table. So about the inner giant, I already discussed in my previous video. So please go through that one. So let's create the temporary table. So add here create. So this already exit this table. So to drop the temporary table, we have to use drop. Drop table and give the name TMP. Okay. And you have to if you execute. So see at here or uh, drop table. So here. Now let's check that again. So at here or uh, Tamp or table doesn't exit. Now let's create the table, temporary table. So add here, execute this query. So add here, are three rows affected and the temporary table created. Now let's execute here. So see add here, this is the record inside TMP table. So when that session is running or when this, or when you are working this so console, so that or till that to temporary table work. Suppose if you uh, exit or close and yeah, let's uh, start again. Let's uh, start again. So and here yeah, I'm logging again. Now here after if you execute this query again. So see at here yeah, it's uh, uh, displaying the masses or, or table or TMP doesn't exit. So when uh, uh, that means at here our temporary table is visible only the current session is run. When you working with the session till that you can use a uh, temporary table. But after uh, closing that to uh, temporary table automatically drop. So when you close the session from temporary table automatically drop. So this is the things about the uh, temporary the table name is you know. Uh, when you are working then temporary work temporary table work and when you close the session it's automatically delete 
now if you want to create again so you have to uh, execute this query so right here it's affected now if you want to check here so here this is three rows affected and this is the records and uh, this records it's a display because i applied this all those things right here so i hope guys you understand the meaning and uses of temporary table in my sql database so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you